do you remember? Regardless of political opinion and partisan politics, ordinary Sri Lankans are being impacted by a massive economic crisis. The people were united in their call for a change in this system. Continuing to maintain divisions along party lines will only serve to push the country further down this dark abyss and benefit politicians. Don't forget how tax concessions given to import sugar resulted in the loss of billions that could have been used to import COVID vaccines when we needed it the most. Even items used by ordinary Sri Lankans such as coconut oil and garlic wasn't spared. Remember the scams that resulted in millions and millions in losses? Why was crucial information on medicine and medical equipment at the NMRA wiped clean all of a sudden? What happened to the investigations? Do you remember how 6.9 million US dollars was paid for a Chinese ship that didn't even unload fertilizer in Sri Lanka? And immediately after that, a mysterious liquid nitrogen fertilizer was imported at exorbitant prices from an Indian company and distributed among innocent farmers. All of this destroyed and wasted your tax money. These are but only a very few incidents of corruption and gross mismanagement of public funds. If we are to report on all incidents of corruption and mismanagement, this news bulletin might have to be telecast continuously over several days. What was the result of all of this? One-sided agreements with foreign nations and companies that has resulted in Sri Lanka losing control of some of our most valuable national assets. What will happen to the American New Fortress Agreement that was signed at midnight? Will the western terminal of the Colombo port be taken back from India's Adani company? What will happen to the act that was passed granting massive tax concessions to businesses at the Chinese Colombo port city? The people who stand in queues for hours to purchase essentials like gas, fuel and medicine can remember well these acts of corruption, mismanagement and the traitorous agreements that were signed. The people will not forget this time.